So this is what uh, Gus has done uh, while uh, building and testing and calibrating okay. these pumps. Yeah, that's, that's the 3 liter RSR. The top line, the blue line, is the maximum full throttle. Then we measure that an opening throttle of 55 degrees, 30 degrees, 16 degrees, and 0 degrees, which would be idle. Okay. And that's how it came out. It's, it's pretty close to... Actually, the specifications are of the factory are much lower. The factory specifications goes only until about 72, but we know with today's fuel we have to go about 8% uh, uh, higher than, than what the factory run in those days on, on their uh, setup on the pumps. And the numbers here at the top on the chart? That's the numbers are the fuel flow cubic millimeter per injection stroke. So this is, uh, every time the piston comes up on maximum throttle it places 82.5 cubic millimeter uh, fuel. Very good. Thank you for explaining that. And what's this other chart here? This is the 28 RSR? the 28 RSR. You see the okay. curve, the fuel load curve is somewhat different than the one on, on, the, yeah. on the 3 liter because they have different space cams in there. This is over the top. Uh, this is um, something that uh, Gus usually does. These are specific to the pumps that I have here with him. And okay. these are the space this cams. This pump takes this space cam, which is a, a V109. Okay, that's for the that. 3 liter. Okay. Here we go. Okay, okay. And that pump here takes the space cam, which is a V94. The 28 RSR, this yeah, is what this two, one is. It's also used on the 2.5. Also two used five, on the 2.5, yeah. Two five, yeah. And, and Very good. And when they went to the slide throttle, they changed the space cam to this different configuration. I don't know if you can see the contours, they're somewhat different. Uh, this here, this line will be about full throttle because the cam turns in this position and here the full throttle looks like this uh, mm. so basically the difference okay now Gus is going to take the pump off the jig and he's going to replace the cover and put it all back together so I can take it home